guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Miss Lauren Lee 11 and today I'm excited to show you a product that's new to me. It's new to me in the sense that I've never used it before, but I've seen it as a child and I just never thought to use it before because my hair wasn't perm, jerry curled. It was just not something that my mum would use on my hair. She used it on her hair. So on my YouTube community, I've posted a picture of some new hair products that I've bought and I'm going to be trying. And I asked you, which one would you prefer for me to try first? And I'm sorry guys, but I've made this choice <laughs> because I know, I know you wanted to see how this one worked as much as I do. And the product I'm talking about today is Oldie But Goodie. Well, I don't know if it's good yet, but Oldie Soft and Free Curl Activator Lotion. And yes, it is from the same brand that I use my Curl Activator Gel. I love this stuff. Now, this one states, it's a Curl Activator Gel for curls, waves, and natural hair. This one, it doesn't say anything about natural hair. So we're gonna see how this goes. It's gonna be interesting. All it says is soft and free two-in-one curl activator with vitamin E and panthenol helps restore moisture loss from hair, making perm and curl maintenance easy, leaving your hair soft and glossy. Okay, so the curl maintenance, could it mean natural hair? Who knows, but I'm going to try it on my natural hair. Price, not too bad at all. It was $2.99 and if this product is a good one, it will be added to my collection of natural hair products that I'm finding on the cheap. I know a few people have commented and saying that and I can't believe you're trying all these old hair products. These have been out for years. Yes, I agree. You're right. They have been out for years, most probably even before I was born. But I never ever stated that they were something new on the market. I'm stating it's new to me trying and that's what I'm doing because I want to help you guys. So I'm going to section my hair as I usually do. Okay guys, I'm gonna have to quickly stop and just explain. Already this is feeling to me more like a leave-in condition than an actual styler. I don't like how it's making my hair look already because I know how my hair's gonna turn out. <sighs> my roots are puffy, my hair seems a bit frizzy. This kind of reminds me of the S-Curl Gel Activator that I like to use as a leave-in. So I mix it with another gel, i.e. Eco Styler. And I feel this is the same vibe I'm getting. I don't even necessarily want to carry on, but for you guys, I will. I'm not really feeling it right now. Guys, I don't really want to put gel on top of this because I think a lot of you are curious as to how it dries, whether it dries greasy, whether it dries dry, whether it makes my hair frizzy. So I think for you guys, I might just put some of that gel on my edges and just see how it mixes. But other than that, um, I'm not going to add any more. I know it doesn't say it's for natural hair, but it doesn't say it's not for natural hair, if you know what I mean. I think it might be okay. I like the fullness and the volume it's given me. Right, so I'm gonna carry on the other side. Um
Okay, so this is what I've got so far. Um, hmm, I don't know. I like the fullness. If it dries like this, I don't mind so much. I feel like I need to use a lot of product, but for 2 dollars it's not bad, is it? Gives me a nice curl definition. Doesn't feel greasy. It, it kind of has like a, a film. No, not a film. That's too strong of a... It's not a film. It's like, it's, it's got a coating. Yeah. It's got a type of coating that you know something is there. Guys, let me know if you want me to do a part two to this video where I mix the gel and the leave-in... Uh, let's see, I'm calling the leave-in conditioner already. <laughs> the gel and the lotion together. If you want to see how those work together, leave a comment down below saying, yes, Lauren, we want to see the mix. I like the fullness. And my hair just feels a lot thicker these days anyway and I know that it's due to the hair grease because it has been keeping in the moisture in my hair. That last video I done where I was using the ORS Curls Gel, sorry I'm going, I'm digressing here, but my hair felt super dry and I had to wash it out on the third day. With the hair grease and the activators, my hair is super moisturised and as you can see guys, quite a few of you have noticed that I'm getting more length. I have noticed that myself since using more of the hair greases and co-activators because my hair is so moisturized. I think I'm gonna leave it to air dry for now. It really just does feel like the S curl gel. Yeah, the S curl gel. I mixed with the Eco Styler. I like it if it stays like this. When I have these kind of activators in my hair, it gets big and it shrinks, which is fine, but it starts to tangle. Guys, you know what I mean. Anyway, I will be back. Actually, no, let me do my, no. I'm gonna do my edges off camera. Sorry guys, I'm so indecisive today. <laughs> I will be back once my hair is fully dried. I'm going to let it air dry. I just wanna get a fair review of this product. So as I said, if you do want me to mix it with a gel, I will, but if not, I will leave it as is. All right, so I'll see you in a minute. Okay guys, so this is my third day here with the Soft and Free Curl Activator Lotion, not gel, lotion. As you can see, I've got a lot of volume. I've got a lot of frizz. I've got a lot of shrinkage. I don't mind it so much. It doesn't feel greasy, guys, at all. You can feel something in your hand, but it's kind of smooth. It's not greasy. I don't mind the end result. I'm not in love with it. Second day hair was better. I tried to stretch it with the hairdryer. It's just not having it. No, nope, it likes the shrunken state, and that's where it stays. But overall, I would recommend it. As I said, guys, if you do want me to layer it with a gel, I might actually layer it with a gel and use this as a leave-in instead. Moisturization on 10. Perfect. Just looks like my is really thick <laughs> all right guys so i hope you enjoyed this video don't forget to like and subscribe and i will see you in the next one bye